Assalamualaikum everyone. Welcome back to our Salam SG channel. For today's art video, I'm going to share with you how you can create greeting cards using mark making technique. Since Hari Raya is around the corner, you can actually make use of simple home items to create these beautiful cards where you can handwrite little notes and send to your loved ones. These are the materials that you need for today. Strings, masking tape, a pair of scissors, a wooden block or something that you can tie the strings around, ice cream stick, a wooden pack some, or something that you can pull the material and these are some optional materials that you might want to add on. A sponge that is really pre-cut into a certain shape. Uh, your child's building block are also great for today's artwork as well as a little piece of um, crush paper that would be nice for texture making later. As for the colours, we are keeping it to only neutral tones so um, white, black and yellow and of course um, a bucket of water with paintbrush. Alright, before we start making the card, um, this step is very important as we are, I'm going to share with you how to prepare the tools. Okay, so for the first tool, we're going to use the wooden block as well as a string and we're going to tie it around the block. Okay, so before that you might want to tear a tape first so it's easier for you to secure them. Okay, and then we're going to just go around making sure that um, the lines are you know um, neatly arranged with consistent distance apart from one another the next one we're going to use the ice cream stick as well as the strings so we're going to cut the strings into a shorter length maybe about like um, 5 or 6 cm I want to soak it for a while so that um, the end of the strings are a little softer. So I'm going to just leave it in the bucket of water. Alright, and lastly, um, we've got a pack, you know, you can just crush it, a piece of paper and pack it. Or if you have like pom-poms or anything that you know you can uh, peg it so that it's easier to print especially for younger children you know they might not be able to hold little things so this peg would be a great idea or a great help for them okay and lastly this you don't need to prepare anything unless your sponge is a big piece you might want to cut it into different shapes all right now we're ready to paint First, we are going to do the mark making using this tool that we've created using a block as well as strings. So you can choose to either put paints here or you can also use the side. Okay, For young children, um, I would suggest you use this side simply because um, they might take a long time to paint the surface and by the time they paint at the end of it, the other parts might get dried. So a smaller surface would work better for them. Okay, another, and another technique is that you can either use a brush to paint the black on the string or you can also dip the tool onto the paint and step. If you want to dip the tool, ensure that the paint is kind of spread evenly out, similar to the length of the tool.
we are going to be using the string and the ice cream stick. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to dip it in the pin. Okay, and we're going to create like big rings and circles from the center. Also try to dip in water and see what happens. For this technique, we're just gonna simply use a sponge. Um, but what's interesting is that we're going to use white paint uh, together with the yellow and paint it on black paper. Uh, especially when you do it with children, they tend to pick up a lot of paint. So you have to tell them that you need to spread it out or else it become very blotchy. Alright, and then you can start. that you have to mix with a bit of white. Alright, for the last technique, I'm going to share with you um, the effect of using a pack and just simple crush paper. Again, we're going to try to do it on black paper. So we're going to use the lighter neutral tones. So all you have to do is just dip. And you get very nice, interesting spots. So when the paints are rather dry, you can actually start folding them and it instantly becomes a card. Inside you can write um, you know, little notes and wishes to your family and friends. Alright, you can also cut it and make it into smaller cards. Handmade 